Hi, my name is Senga Lindsay. I'm in North Vancouver. I'm a landscape architect. And today I'm going to show you simple, easy ways you can tuck strawberries for growing and eating in your own garden. This is the first idea in our little herb garden pot here. We got some oreganos, we've got some um, trailing rosemary, and there we go. There's our strawberries. Simple, easy. These are ever-bearing varieties. You want to have these kind of varieties so that you will always have strawberries all summer long. Strawberries prefer full sun, but as you can see, they're growing in partial shade here, and they're still fruiting, no problem. And we also have some nasturtiums tucked next to these strawberries, and this is what we call companion planting. So check out our blog in future, and we'll be talking about what makes companion planting so good for strawberries. So let's go into uh, our backyard and I'm going to show you some other funky, easy ideas to grow your strawberries. Voila! Table centerpiece. Strawberry tower. Favorite color, red. Love this pot and look at here. Well, we're getting some little guys already growing. It's another great funky way to grow strawberries in a new modernized version of a Mexican strawberry pot. White glazed, contemporary. We already got some nice little berries already fruiting up. Another week or so, bam, harvesting and eating. What a great idea. And we're heading up to our rooftop. Unfortunately, we do not have full square access yet, but coming soon, checking out our strawberries up here on our edible green roof. Up top now of our edible green roof, you can see all the veggies on this side. Heading past our raised beds and our three hives of bees, who incidentally will pollinate our strawberry crops, which voila, just happen to be along this raised planter bed. And as you can see, they're already starting to fruit and ready to eat. Mmm, perfect from your own garden, organic, can't get any better than that.